But we got a skunk issue right now in our uh, front tack room. So we need to get that problem taken care of and that out of there because that would be a bad deal. But he'll be gone by then. That was Rex, not a skunk. Just been stressing him out though. He wants in there real bad. We do not need that. Okay, welcome back to Stokes Family Ranch. We have been getting things ready in the barn, ready for Christmas on the prairie. It's coming up. It's Saturday, four more days. Are we ready? Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. It's not Saturday today. No, so today is Tuesday. Christmas on the Saturday. prairie is Saturday. Gotcha. <laughs> Everything's ready to go. We're all set up. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. We are just heading back from Titus's scrimmage. Hi, Titus. <laughs> he played a, he had a scrimmage in Grove this morning, so we headed out and watched that. And now we're heading back home. But um, we are not ready. But we will be. Or we'll get there. we got to get some more things set up. Um, yeah. Just a few. We have a few things to do still. Dan's working. Get our lights up. Got some helpers over here. Some spectators. Some spectators. <laughs> See the Molly girl? She's almost camouflaged. In the leaves. Poor little Millie. She got she got fixed on Friday, so she's still herself, but she'll play real hard and then she kinda get tired, huh? Yeah. You getting sleepy. I'm scooting along there. Kind of can get slick with a uh, metal roof. He's uh he's actually fallen off before, <laughs> off the backside. Started sliding and couldn't stop. He bailed. Is it slick? Huh? Is it slick? Nah, too bad. Good. It'll happen. It'll happen. We're earlier this year. We've never had the Christmas on the prairie this early, but we wanted to try it. Last week we um, helped Derek with a little league basketball tournament, so we were pretty well all out of pocket for that. And then this weekend we had a youth conference, which was great and lots of fun. Um, we were at over at New Life Ranch. So if you guys have never checked out New Life Ranch, you need to check that out. It used to be Dry, dry Gulch, and they had the Christmas train there. But it was it was it's a fun place. Did you enjoy it, Titus? Yeah. What was your favorite part? The dodgeball they had glow in the dark dodgeball so yeah i'm sure that was fun we missed out on that part but they had indoor basketball they had all kinds of good stuff the go -karts. lakes right there go-karts uh one of those big jumping blob things anyways go check it out if your church needs a place that is a great spot to rent and have a retreat so that's what we did this weekend with the youth and um then yesterday we started fluffing the trees getting everything ready and uh it was kind of rainy we didn't get tons done but we got a little bit but exciting news the stokes family puppeteers are coming back for making a comeback making a comeback for hopefully not one night only and never again but come back tour 2020 <laughs> that's right 
So they're going to perform a couple of times on Saturday night for the youngins. And um, it's so cute. One of them is the little packages. And then the other one, which is my one of my favorites, is the camels. You don't want to miss the camel song. I had a question again earlier today. How much does it cost to get in? It is free admission. All of the proceeds this time we're doing donation only. And the donations will go to... Locust Grove Schools lunch program. So we are not free and we are not free lunches this year. We do have some reduced lunches, but not free lunches. And we still have lots of families that are just right on that threshold. And lunches, I mean, everything has gone up this year. So we want to help any way that we can. So that's an area that we were thinking we could give back. Well said. Okay. Thank you. It definitely is a scene. Go, go look, look between I, that refrigerator. It's, it's, it's just, it's like, I can't I, spray. I, 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 Millie, I, I, no. You will get sprayed. You are small. Oh, I don't see it. <gasps> yeah, I do. Get out there. Oh. Oh, it's a skunk in there. Ah. No, I found a, pot, a skunk in there. Nasty. It is nasty. We uh, probably need that out of here before this weekend, huh? You don't see it? I don't see it anymore. Did it go behind the refrigerator? I might see something, but I don't know if that's it. No, I see it. That's probably it's back in, ready to spray. Ew. I didn't see the reefs up there. Trying to get this place transformed. Derek's in there with a skunk. We don't know what's happening. Don't let Millie Olivia's trying to get back down. Too. Oh, I see your head, Philip. Um, uh, uh, yes, I see your head. Not a lot. I don't know. Okay. They're going to do our puppets. We could put. Okay. Getting all the stuff out. Let's get in there. Pettis getting our little snow people fixed up, brightening up their letters and their eyes. Need a little TLC, huh? Yeah. Okay, get all the trees moved over. Out of the way for right now. We're gonna use these to just to block off this part order. Um, only going to use this for puppets this year. Kids can sit in this area. What? It's kind of a rainy day today, so we can't put out any of the lights. The house lights are on. Phil and Diana got the pavilion wreath up. There's lights already on that. We can't get the lights on the silo yet or put the trees out over there. But um, we'll get there. It's getting there. See, it's just kind of a rainy dreary day and we don't want to drive around in this area with the tractor because it'll make it really nasty and bumpy for Saturday all this right behind me so just kind of waiting and I just thought we'd get trees fluffed today get everything out of the playhouse so we can get 
um, get ready for Santa's workshop. Pulled all this stuff out, got the big trees up. Um, we're gonna paint, finish painting my trim on our little barn. It's about ready. It did just, we didn't get to that trim yet, but that's okay, we're getting there. And then uh, gonna hang a couple of banners in here, and then the rest of in here will be for vendors, so we won't have to do tons in here. Just getting it cleaned up and getting the stuff out of the way. And then this, this stuff we just set all around, like leading towards Santa's workshop and just welcoming people. So what else? Anything else? This thing gonna happen Saturday? I hope. I hope the <laughs> weather holds out good. Yeah, it's gonna be a little chilly. It's gonna be 50, we hope. But we'll have all the fire pits going. Um, people can get in the barn. It's a little bit warmer in here. Uh, we'll have the pavilion fire pits going. Santa's workshops. Good. It's a. It'll be warm there for Santa. You'll be warm in there for Santa. That's right. And then uh, animals won't care. They'll be fine too. So it's getting ready. Vendors have confirmed. Um, our food trucks. Tad a pig. Pig is coming. He's confirmed. Uh, walkers are confirmed. They're coming. We've got a couple of other YouTubers that are planning to be here. So, here we go. We're ready. Dan's cleaning off some cobwebs. <laughs> we'll have our hot cocoa stand set up. We need to get that going. And go about there. Get the pavilion decorated. Get our doors up over there and our little picture booth. And I think, I think that's it that I can think of right now. Okay, we're heading out here to the barn. Let's see if... Uh, Derek set that live trap yesterday. Let's see if um, if he caught it. Sweet. I really need that skunk gone before Saturday. I feel like there's one in there every year before we have this. Yep. I like it in there. It's warm and toasty, I guess, and there's hay. So, thankfully, it has not sprayed. So, if we can yet. Hopefully, it does not. And we can keep the dogs away from it. Titus. Then uh, maybe we can whew, remedy this situation quick. Get back, Rex. He wants in real bad. Not coming on. What? Hmm. Is it in there? Oh. Can you tell? Oh. <laughs> it's pretty. Flip the light on and off a couple times, it'll come on. There it goes. Here, let's do this. Stick the camera in there. Just gauge. I don't even know if it's in there. There's a bag over it. It's poking the other way. Huh? It's poking the other way. You don't have to go all the way in. This one's got bites all out of it. How are you going to know if it's in there? Well, I'm going to just drag it out. Or assume it's in there. Oh, I look. See, there's something that eating at it. Hold on, let me get out of here. What's in there? Okay. It does stink a little bit. Does it feel heavy? Can you feel? Anything moving? It's I don't all over, I think. I don't think it's ever in there. I think it try to get in. 
I don't see it in there. You see it? I see poop. I'll let you. You think? I mean, the door's closed on it. I know, but. Okay, well, drag it out in the field, I guess. Yeah, drag it out in the field and <laughs> rip it open. Why don't you drag it out in the field? Make it your job. Why do you think it's in there? Well, it may have tripped it and got out. I don't think it could get out fast enough. You gonna peek? <laughs> Snot? Nope. No. <laughs> I didn't think it was. <laughs> Well, maybe there was a. I think he set two traps. Maybe it was in the other one. Huh? I think he set two traps. Maybe it was in the other one. But yeah, it tripped the door. I think it wanted to get in there. Hmm. Well, shucks. Hopefully. Hopefully, Derek got it. We can call him, see if he got the other trap working and got it in there. I don't know where. Where did he put that other trap? Hmm. Rex is after something. There in the very back of the barn. Very back of the barn? Yeah, I'll take that one. The door is shut. It is. Honey uh, bun and the food are still in there. The, uh, Yeah, the, that one's door's not. The door's still door's open. open. So I'm on the one back. Yep. Yeah, I'm not trying to reset that one. Hey, do you see what Travis is doing? Yeah. Well, that's no boy no. Okay, well, we'll get that <laughs> taken care of. Come on out. We will not have a skunk problem the night of our event. We never have. We're not going to start now. It's going to be great. We don't have tons done, but we're getting there. Hope to get another video out before the actual event this week as we transform more things and get more done. But wanted to just kind of update you on what was happening. And I forgot to introduce ourselves. We have a lot of new followers here. I am Lonnie Stokes. I'm Daniel Stokes. Titus Stokes. Titus and our daughter Tatum is at basketball practice right now. But we live... Um, Stokes Family Ranch in between um, Dan's younger brother and his parents. We all three live out there on what, 180 acres, 160 acres? Uh, it's also called the Promised Land. The Promised Land is what, the, what uh, some pref refer to it as. Out there on the prairie, it is, we do have uh, some pretty, pretty good views and sunsets and all that. We cannot complain. It is a beautiful place to live. I have about 40 head of cattle. Uh, at our house, yeah. Yeah, at that property. There's another property, and there's about that same amount, maybe a little bit more. And we have some pigs and dogs and chickens and cat. Cat. And Derek and Katie have the goats uh, over on Stoked Living, right next door. I say next door. There's a lot of acreage between us, but um, there are neighbors. And then back behind us is uh, his, Dan's aunt and uncle and cousins, and uh, we just kind of built on the family homestead, the original um, property that his grandparents owned. We have been there for 15 years now, and um, you grew up there. The, Dan grew up right next door at um, his parents' house. But we, we just want to share a little bit about our life and what it's like around here, living on the farm, and... It's never a dull moment. Never a dull moment. 
you see some stuff with our school because that's very much our life and youth group and what's happening in our church and just our mission here is just to show some good country hospitality and country life and just open it up to you guys as much as we can as well as raising a couple teenagers wild and crazy <laughs> We are definitely not wild and crazy. Well, it gets a little wild and crazy with some skunks. Hopefully, that's, that's not a uh, Ugh, regular occurrence. <laughs> but we hope you guys have a great rest of your week. And we'll hope to see you Saturday night at Christmas on the Prairie. God bless. <laughs>